All right, what's going on, guys? It's George Plays here, and I just died. Back with another video. Now, I'm sorry, uh, I didn't li uh, live stream tonight, and it's because uh, I was at work, and I put it on Twitter, but instead on Twitter, I put my best friend. And it's really my girlfriend, and I got a text, I'm assuming from her family, saying she quit breathing, and she wasn't waking up. Man, I suck. So, that's why I didn't live stream uh, after work, but and I didn't get out until like 3.30 anyway, but enough with that. That was just explaining why I didn't go live. Now this is gonna be a modern warfare kind of type deal. I'm gonna describe. I'm gonna explain what I want to see in the game and what I don't want to see in the game over some gameplay on Call of Duty Black Ops 3. So, without further ado, while we wait, one kill, five deaths. That's bad. Anyway, my I, what I wanted to see in the game is I want to see, and I already watched all the gameplay trailers, everything, and I want to see um more balanced weapons, if you will, like it. Let me explain that in the best way I can. Some of the Call of Duty weapons um, from previous Call of Duties ain't that balanced, if you know what I mean. And I think some of you do. It just simply means... And I'm going to give an example. Advanced Warfare. All the weapon sounds sounded the same. Almost all the weapon sounds. And just everything in general wasn't really good about that multiplayer I believe it was the first multiplayer to really introduce all the supply drop nonsense I believe so unless they introduced that in Ghosts but I'm pretty sure Advanced Warfare is where it started that was the one of the main flaws about Advanced Warfare was the supply drops sucked beyond belief and the other thing that sucked was the unbalanced weapons. They it sounded like they were using the same gun sounds, and it was just their first take on a futuristic Call of Duty game. And Call of Duty games aren't about future, if you will. It's about really where it started. Boots on the ground combat that uses some sort of skill set to kill the enemies in multiplayer, and. So, Modern Warfare, I want to see more balanced guns. So from the gameplays I've seen in the gameplay trailers, all the gun sounds have a different sound to them. They sound more realistic. The guns have a more realistic look to them. The guns reload realistic, if that makes sense. I don't even know. <laughs> and, and to be fair, this is the first Call of Duty game I'm actually going to pre-order ever. So... I got um, also, Crispy Concords, if you don't know who that is, look him up on YouTube. You should subscribe to him and uh, like his videos and stuff. He shows gameplay. Uh, he already showed a game. He was invited to the event, and he uh, showed some gameplays, and he confirmed that traffic cones can be movable. So, yes, a long-waited wait for that but they can be removable they can be not removable but movable by guns so yes you got that and then he also uh, showed that and it's quads mode or whatever um that you can drive these little vehicles around so that's good I don't think you can drive any cars or anything unless they implement that into the game but you can drive 
these like doom buggy things. So that's good. And multiplayer. Finally, we have vehicles. So a long way to decision. I just sprinkled that, dude. Also, what I don't want to see is. But I know we're probably going to get some maps like this is three lane maps. If you don't know what that is, basically maps uh, you get to have three lanes you can go into left, right, or in the middle. And I believe World War II had a lot of those three lane maps. I think Black Ops 4 had a lot of those three lane maps. And Modern Warfare seems like it's going to have at least maybe one or two three lane Hopefully only like one or two. It wouldn't fully kill the game, but it would kill it in some sort of way. And nobody really likes three lane maps. For one, I hate them. I hope it's just like, you know, the original Modern Warfare games. I just got RPG'd. Um, where you have classic like that. Hopefully there's no remastered maps. I I was hoping there will be no remastered laps, maps in Black Ops 4 but there was. Which wasn't a bad thing but it wasn't a good thing either. So I'm hoping there's no remastered maps in Black Modern Warfare because if they're truly going to reboot it they shouldn't have to use remastered maps to really reboot and it's just a soft reboot and I've seen the campaign trailer because that was the first trailer released and boom Captain Price is back so I know the, uh, it's gonna be a great game and I'm gonna do gameplay videos on the multi on the campaign first before I start the multiplayer because you know I gotta I gotta play campaign first and experience it with you guys before I can play the multiplayer and I'll probably live stream like four hours of the multiplayer first but uh yeah so hopefully no three lane maps hopefully all the weapon sounds have a unique feel to ha have just more more realistic gun sounds and from the gameplay it looks like the bullets actually when we shoot them from some of the guns that hits the ground so that's realistic. It looks like the weapon reload animations are realistic. And they're using um, an actual, that the graphics look better than any COD game before, I think in general. And some of the other YouTubers think that it looks very good, very different. But it has like, I heard it had, Crispy Concord said it has that old school, or somebody said old school COD, I don't think it was Crispy. Uh, old school Call of Duty feel still, but with just a more realistic feeling, realistic setting. Oh, and there's cutscenes at the beginning of probably every match. So hopefully, when they do the cutscenes, hopefully they actually change some of them, like update the game every once in a while, change some of those cutscenes to where. Uh, we won't get to see the same old ones again and again. But yeah, it's just my my thoughts on the game. It's gonna be a good game this year. I can feel it, and hopefully they exclude all the money hungry, greedy stuff like the supply drops and the uh, what's it we call it um the the depots and stuff. Where you can actually buy other stuff and earn camos through there. Hopefully they do that because I want hashtag I want my old called Call of Duty back. And hopefully it's a new generation for new Call of Duty fans that are much younger than me. Since I'm almost 20 to experience a Call of Duty game from back in the golden days. But with rebooted mechanics and stuff. And just rebooted in general with a nice fresh campaign. So those are my thoughts. Uh, are you guys going to be pre-ordering? Or are you not? Let me know in the comment section below. And that guy just flashed me. Um, because I'm definitely going to pre-order it. Because as a YouTuber, 
and uh, kind of a big Call of Duty fan, I gotta say. I gotta say, I gotta pre-order it and play and do gaming videos on the campaign for you guys, and then I could stream the multiplayer like for half a month. But that's what, just what I want in the game, what I don't want in the game. What I want in the game is um, basically weapons that sound very realistic, not three lane maps. Uh, it's alright if there's like one or two three lane maps, but that's alright. Uh, hopefully they stick through with the word. Hopefully there's no supply drops or depots or anything. Hopefully you can do what it was like like back in Call of Duty, the original Call of Duty Modern Warfare where there was actual stuff that you can earn actual stuff but that's the video for right now I thank you guys for every, if you support this channel by clicking that sub button hitting like and checking my channel out more so than usual Sorry there wasn't a live stream tonight. It's uh, currently 5.49 in the morning. So after I do am done editing and uploading this video, I'll probably hit the sack for a couple hours. But my live streams will probably return tomorrow night. Thank you all, and I hope you have a safe night.